Hello, today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa. I am a cruelty-free YouTuber trying <laughs> to find my way back to YouTube. I've been kind of off for a while. I'm doing my best. And today I... when I woke up... or okay, yesterday when I was going to bed I was like, I want to do a springy, bright, fun look. And today I woke up and it was snowing outside. It's the middle of April. I don't know what the hell is going on. So I'm not going to do a spring look because it's snowing. Uh, but I'm going to do a pillow bingo with the club Nebula. Ne outside of YouTube, I know exactly how to pronounce this on YouTube. Club Nebula palette. The Kaleidos and Anilke Nyqvist collab. I got this in Pure. So happy I got it. I would have bought it. So I'm going to do a palette bingo with this. And I don't know if I'm going to do... I think I'm just going to do a normal palette bingo. And if you don't know how the palette looks, it looks like this. It has 15 colors. It's both brights, darks. It has like everything. So I will go to random.org, take five colors, and then we will see how this will turn out. And can I remember this when not writing it up? Mm, I might. I don't know if you can see this, I don't know, but first five, two, eight, five, two, eight, twelve. And 11. So I got these colors. So this is 5, 2, 8, 12, and 11. I don't know if you can see the two lost shades, but these are the shades I got. So I'm guessing I will do something blue. And the only thing, this feels kind of similar to look at what we're done with this palette, but I'm going to do this. So I will just prime my eyes and then we'll get started. I'm going to start my look with taking 7 of 9 in my crease and then I'm going to take Void out here and maybe a little bit in my crease. I will see how that looks. And this is a feeling I have when I do palette bingos with the palette that I have used sometimes. Um, it's often like it can be like I get the colors that I've already used, and I think in my um, I did a two looks one palette with this one, and I think I did a look with kind of like these colors, but I'm going to try to do something a little bit different. So we will see how that will go. I'm going to start with this 7 of 9 in my crease. And I think like the hardest thing right now for me, with me not posting videos, one of the reasons is because I don't get any like inspiration, so I don't know what to do for kind of makeup. So I was like, maybe palette bingo is a good thing. Because then I at least don't need to think about the colors I want to use, so... But now I'm starting to <laughs> second guess myself, but... At least it will do something and maybe spark like my inspiration. I can at least hope for that. So I'm going in with Void out here and then I actually think I will take... Nova? On this one and like cut do a cut crease but I can't remember did I try to do that and it didn't work super good so maybe I should take celestial this one I don't know I can't remember because some of these are more like duochrome toppers and they might not work super great with glitter glue because they don't have such a strong base. I just 
just want to take you out here also feel like I want to drag it a little bit in my crease maybe this wasn't a good brush to take in my crease hmm. it went a bit better on this side it usually don't go better at this side hmm. so for my the rest of my lid I'm going to take Nova and I really hope this will work. I can't remember if this is like too without its own base. So I'm going to cut this crease. But I think this will look the best because this has some purple in it and I think it will look really cool. Like purpley blue. And I guess that will look really cool together with the blue. So I will try this at least. Then I'm going to tap out the edge. And then we're going in with Nova and we will see. I might have tried this before and it didn't. Go oh, great. No, this is going super great. Have I done one of these looks? I'm starting to quit questioning myself actually. Okay, this looks really, really cool. I'm just going in a little bit with void just to fix it here I'm really liking this so I'm actually going off cam and cut this crease and do the same and then do my base because you don't need to see me cut both of my crease so I'm going to fix that and then I come back for my under eyes I'm going to go in with Astro this one I don't know if this will like stick to my lower lash because it's not have any primer down there but I will try I take my trusty brush for this we'll see hopefully this will work and now I'm going to say something that I don't know if I should say I then watch my two looks one palette the Kaleidos and you know what this is like one of those looks but I don't feel like I had much choice and I actually like this look so much more than the look I did in my two looks one palette and also if I wouldn't say something about it I don't know if you would have noticed that it looks kind of the same and I think that is just things that happens when you do a lot of makeup okay I don't do a lot of makeup now but I'm surprised <laughs> that it doesn't happen more often if I'm going to be honest and I feel like my youtube friends understand what I mean but at the same time this was a palette bingo and I guess things like this happen then. Okay. Got some of the fallouts. So for the last shade that is Celestial. This one I think I will just take these way out and pop it in my inner corner. I'm not thinking I'm going to do it. No, I got too much. Okay, so I'm just going to pop something in my waterline, put on mascara, I choose a lippy and then I come back with the finished palette bingo look. It is not me without a red lip, <laughs> so I took Rogue Assessed. Rogue Assessed. Rogue Assessed. Rogue Assassin from Nabla. This is discontinued, but I love this color and 
I think it suits really good. So this is my palette bay look with the Club Nebula palette from Kaleidos together with Angelica Nyqvist and I love this look. I think this is better than a look I did in my two looks one palette. So I did use or I got 7 of 9 Void Astro Celestial and Nova. And this Nova shade, it is freaking amazing on the eye. And where it meets Void, it is like purple, dark purpley blue. I just love it. So I'm really, really pleased with this look. It feels like I got like... I did the same look, but I did it better. And I don't know why I even mentioned that it looks the same, because I don't know if you would have thought about it. I don't think you have such good... I don't know that... I don't think that you know that much. Or, okay, wait, what am I trying to say? I don't think that you have such, like... I don't think you remember all my looks. And maybe it's some of you, this is your first video with me you're seeing. But yeah, I really like this look. It's, it looks so much better. I love it. I love it with the red lip. Red lips is the best. And I will leave all the info about the restock of this palette down in the description. I can recommend it. Kaleidos does one of my absolute favorite formulas. And... I am on Kaleidos PR list, but I didn't love them before and I have bought my first palettes, I bought my own and I also bought some highlighters and blushes from Kaleidos with my own money, so it's just one of my favorite brands. So yeah, I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do. I will see you when I will see you. I don't know when the next video will come. I'm just trying to go with the flow right now. Or with the non-existing flu. Flu. <laughs> flow. <laughs> I will see you when I see you. I really hope you like this. And yeah. I hope I'll see you next one. Bye.